Hi, I'm Natalie Rose. I'm going to show you how to build a sunny side up solar car. Let's get started. All you need are a pair of scissors and your kit. First, get your pieces ready. Here are all the things you will need to make your solar car. A rectangular coroplast frame, a push pin, four metal screw eyes, two wooden blocks, two wooden axle shafts, four wooden wheels, a piece of sandpaper, a piece of rubber tubing, a red plastic pulley wheel, a motor mounting clip, a motor, an elastic band, and last but not least, a solar panel with alligator clips. Now that you have everything, take your coroplast frame and choose which end will be the front. On this car, this will be the front, and this will be the back. Take your push pin and mark the holes for the screw eyes. The screw eyes will hold the axle that your wheels go on, so make your holes parallel to the front and back edge of the car. Twist the screw eyes through the coroplast and into the wooden blocks. Make sure that the eye of the screws are all sideways. Now take the two wooden axle shafts. Check the ends and sand them lightly if you need to. The shorter axle goes at the front of the car and the long axle goes at the back. Now get your piece of rubber tubing and use scissors to cut it into four pieces. Each piece should be about half a centimeter long so that it will prevent the wheels from rubbing against the frame of the car. Put the axle shafts through the holes in the screw eyes. Put one piece of tubing on each end of both axles. It's almost time to put on the wheels of the car, but first you need to attach the red pulley. Slide the pulley onto the axle at the back of your car and then slide a wheel on. Repeat for the remaining three wheels. Flip the car over. Now it's time to attach the motor. First, snap the motor into the mounting clip and decide where to put it on the car. The elastic band will stretch from the pulley to the motor, so you want the motor close to the red pulley at the back of the car, but not right next to it. Test positions with the elastic. When you are ready, peel the paper off of the sticky back on the mounting clip and stick it to the frame. Now, add the elastic. Slip the elastic around the red pulley wheel and red part of the motor. The last piece to add is the solar panel, which has two alligator clips attached to it. The solar panel can lean against the wooden block and the motor. There are two small metal terminals at the back of the motor. Attach an alligator clip to each terminal. Now all you have to do is add sun. When the sun hits the solar panel, it will be converted into mechanical energy to power your car. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make a sunny side up solar car. See you next time.